first thing we have to do is figure out how to load this drum this is the winding key right here it is clipped into the little tab right here so you have to find out where the little opening is and push it away from the opening and I will try and show you if it will focus there's the little clip right here there's the little clip right there and you can see it underneath it so we're gonna push it that way to release it so in a sense this tab right here is going to go into this hole and you push it this way to lock it in and you push it that way to release it and just pull straight up and this comes right off now <coughs> this just lifts up just pry it up comes right out and there is a specific way you load the rounds but you can see on the top lid the tracks right here and there's a see how it gets skinny right here you'll see the same thing on the bottom but you see the tracks that the rounds will eventually make their way through to the feeding hole right here that goes into the Tommy gun so I'm gonna set this over here here's the bottom all right and I'm gonna save you the painstaking time of watching me load round one by one so I'm gonna go ahead and load this and then show you when I'm done what it looks like all right, pay close attention to where the feeding hole is which is right here and we're going to load counterclockwise alright so pay close attention to where this is and you'll see why here in just a second alright you can see one round right here where the feeding hole is and that's what you want and you've got ten rounds and we're just going to keep going around this way and I'll show you the last two holes are very important I'll show you here in a minute alright we're finished loading make sure that one round is right here where the hole is to go up into the weapon where it feeds into and if you will notice there is a pattern here going counterclockwise we have ten rounds one for each row the outer rim and the inner rim ten 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 10 and on these last two there's only five and it's on the outside rim not this inside track right here but the outside track very important because it gets very narrow right here number one these rounds won't fit in here and then you'll ruin everything and it, it won't feed and you have all kinds of problems so make sure that these last rounds right here these last five and these last five stay on the outside track and now we're ready to put everything back together and this will be loaded so now the lid goes back on make sure the notch here that the rounds come through matches the notch here and you have that first round right there in that notch and you line up the notches like so I'll turn it around good gosh that's heavy all right like so now you put your key back on this hole here goes over this right here and you push it this way so it locks into that slot all right so you move it like this to where there now you're ready to wind it and it says on here I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this it says wind 9 to 11 clicks right here I don't know if you can see that that's okay so we are going to wind it 9 to 11 clicks and you can see the tabs here obviously you'll be winding it this way One two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It says 9 to 11, so we'll do 10, which is in between 9 and 11. All right, that's done. Ready to roll. You saw it here on the Po' Boy Special Channel.